Alrighty, BB, we are in downtown Lakeland. And today is Tasty Tuesdays. Yes, it is. Okay, this is an event that happens every third Tuesday of the month. It starts at 4.30 mm -hmm. to 9. 5.30 right there in Munn Park. The band will start playing. Uh, and we can start walking that way. Basically, it's $25. It uh, doesn't have to be a person. Two people can share uh, the tickets. You get 10 tickets, and there's participating restaurants where you get samples of food. And they give you a map and everything to it. Uh, then after that, you can buy, for $5, you can buy two tickets at increments. Uh, if you don't use your tickets, of course, you can save them for the next event. So, well, that's a win win, right? There. Right, right. So, me and you don't have to buy $25 each. We can buy $25 and we share right. the thing. Okay. And uh, what does it say up there on your. Because they give you a map and, and the list of the restaurants, but what does it say as far as that goes? Like, Tasty Tuesday is a self guided tasting event every third Tuesday of the month. Present a ticket for the sample at each business. You can use more than one ticket per location if you choose. Please take your samples to go unless you plan to order additional food or beverage to enjoy with your sample. If you do sit down to enjoy your sample, please be sure to tip your server. Yep, and those are the list of the restaurants. And we're going to go all through them and show the map. And that's the map basically there. Other than these, you're going to have to pretty far walks. The rest of them are going to be around there. Around the main street, yeah. yeah. So, do you have your watch on to count the miles so we can see how many miles we're going to do? Yes, I do, but let okay. me get there. Okay, you go get that ready. And... Uh, the battery died? Okay, then don't worry. <laughs> it's always something. That's okay. I'll do it on my phone. Okay. If all else fails, use backup. Because the first one we're going to go to is Teriyaki Madness. We did not purchase the tickets. We're just going to show you basically what the tour is about uh, here. And show you the restaurants that are participating. Now, maybe next time we come out here, we will probably participate in it. But we just finished eating. And uh, this was just something that popped up was just unexpected. Yes, yeah, so I've got it set for one mile. Let's see if we pass that. Oh, okay. Well, well it'll keep going. Okay. Okay, let's go. All right, first stop, Teriyaki Madness. Now, we were almost near the Mun Park, the center of the park. So, and this is good for dates. Uh... You can see other shops while you're here as well. Sightsee. Because like I said, they give you a map, so that's the good thing. A lot of nice shops. I mean, that's the good thing along the way as you're doing this. You can show up. Yeah. And in that piece oh, of paper, swans. in that piece of paper that you have too, it tells you what uh, each restaurant will offer. Yes, like the Terry. Well, okay. let's go right here. That's the Teriyaki Madness on Kentucky and eBay. Okay, what does Teriyaki Madness offer? Four ounce sample bowl with white rice, mixed vegetables, and your choice of protein. Okay. All right, let's go for the map. See where number two is at. Number two. Swan Brewing, which is, what street are we on? Swan Brewing is gonna be. That way. Swan Brewing, yeah. I think it's gonna be that way, that we went to that rock thing. Yeah. That's gonna, see, that's the long walk. It's the Swan Brewing to here, uh, to three, four, and five. Once you get after seven, 
then everything else is just literally right next to each other yeah. around the block mm -hmm. but there's other places here even though they're not participating like this place you know books and coffees mm -hmm. like i said even though they're not participating but the thing is at least you get to see like the bay street bistro at yeah. least you get to see what else is here so if you ever decide to come out here during the week or the weekend you know what's here yeah you have an idea especially for the food aspect because then you know like well okay we're there what are we gonna eat we're gonna stay a while you know it's not like oh so that's bay street we gotta go up the street yeah, we can walk on what to call it on the highway there. Nice thing is if you're into photography, they got some beautiful wall art pictures as well. If you're into videos like we are. And this is Florida Avenue. Does it say what street that's on? Is Yeah. Yeah, that was that place we went for because it's over there. Yeah. That was that place we went for the punk rock where we seen uh, Adam DeWoo. Oh. And they got alleyways. More art. Some buildings that were original to the time. This one here looks like a mausoleum. This one here looks like a mausoleum. I know what that looks like. Okay, this is the Swan Brewery. Like I said, we've been here before. And the other good thing too, there's a lake. Mm -hmm. So you wanna walk around the lake, especially around the holidays, they decorate and stuff. So what does the Swan Brewery offer? Any taster of Swan beer, beers made in-house or cider lager, and you must be 21 years old. Okay, so that's your second stop. All right, let's go right to the- across the street from the post office. Yes. Yeah, the downtown post office. Yeah. All right, next stop, number three yes, is, is Rec Room, which is. Uh, that's right over there with the. Yeah. I don't know if it's the one that's near the police station or we got to make a right and then a left. Well, it's right here on Pine Street. Well, Pine and Cedar. Cedar. Yeah, so we got to cross the railroad track. Uh, and then make a left by Jimmy John's. Yes. Okay. So this one's gonna be on Cedar Street. Yes. And that's getting near the park. Now we're getting closer to the park area. Yeah. And if you don't feel like walking, you just take a ride, you know? And if you wanna use all your tickets in one spot, just say you're not into the other food and you just wanna go and drink with a bunch of people, well, then you get that ticket and you share it and uh, you get a bunch of drinks. You guys decide you want to eat, you can all do it in one restaurant. There's no, like, you have to try every restaurant. Nope. And then once you run out of the 10, you could buy, like I said, two more $5 increments. And whatever you don't use again, you use it for the next third Tuesday. And just to let you know that the train tracks here in downtown Lakeham are active. So if you have kids or you're not paying attention, you need to pay attention. Because the trains do run through here. A lot. Cultivating.
<laughs> oh, they got an escape room here too, as well. Uh, classic cuts, spotlight, realty, title loan place. I, I know there's a crispers over there. track who knows prime might be on there police station straight ahead a boutique shop there all right and they're getting ready for the concert and the rec room is down there so and the tickets are at 117 Alrighty. So a lot of people do participate in this. We were just talking to some ladies mm -hmm. and they were looking for the ticket thing. Now this is the rec room. What the rec room offers, it's a gaming and a bar place. And on certain nights of the week, they'll have a food stand yeah. out there. So if you're into like games, like video games or I don't know if there's pinball machines, but I know that there's games in there and pool. And it's a bar, and again, they set up for food. They don't serve food, but they set up for a food truck out here or something. Right, with this, you get three choices. Five ounce portion of our frozen drink, squashy, or uh, that one beer, uh, Medallo, or a get a taste of the action with two fifty dollars worth of game tokens okay so. all right and the next place it's going to be mayday ice cream which is on main street okay which is going up that way okay let's go check out well that's massachusetts so that's maine so we got to go back yeah. that way okay mayday ice cream mm -hmm. Like I said, if you're smart, you know the alleys, you go down the alleys. Very photographic area. Yes. Down here in Lakeland. All right, let's just keep going. Check out that bike, electric bike. That's a big boy. Yeah, it is. Check them tires out. Holy cow. <laughs> And this, oh, Main Street is this way. Okay. Mm -hmm. And this is where you would get the tickets at. You see it says purchase tickets here yep. for Tasty Tuesday. Or you can buy them online as yeah. well. All right, there you go. But this is it here. And then it shows here, there's a lot of other events. Tasty Tuesday, food truck rally, second Thursdays from six to nine, they uh, have a bunch of food truck. First uh -huh. Fridays, six to nine, May 5th, is the market classic thing, special events, 421 Night Live, that's this Friday, mm -hmm. and 519 is movie night at the Lake Promenade. Over there. Right, and they got downtown farmer's market every Saturday, close August 8th, over 100 vendors, 429 is taste of the market, eight to two, 10 tickets for $10 sample our food vendors. So there okay, you go. So that's something else there. And that's where you would get everything from uh -huh. is right there. 117 Kentucky Avenue. And if you're into uh, Louisiana food, you can come to this place. Yeah. Spicy. This has been here forever. You're not taking these people down. <laughs> All right, you're going to the right. I'm going to the right for Mayday Ice Cream? Yes. Okay. Oh no, we gotta go to the left. Later okay. Later. Let's check it out.
Oh, I think I know where Maddie Ice Cream is. That's over there in the joinery, isn't it? <laughs> Son of a gun, yeah. We could have went straight ahead. Yep. We didn't know it turned into Main Street. That's okay. All right, we're gonna take the shortcut. And this is Lake Mirror, right? Yes, Lake Mirror. My beautiful lakes. I love that. That's sky. where we did a, a video over there of a wedding. Yeah, we crashed that one. Yeah, we crashed the wedding. They were nice enough to let us crash the wedding in the yeah. videotape. <laughs> right. And no, that was not a toot. That was me stepping on a rock. And the joinery, that's where the ice cream place is, is by the train station. Yep. And sorry for the wind, guys. It's a beautiful day. This building here, here is new. It's a new parking garage. And this is Lake Mirror. And the botanical garden is right over there. Okay, and that's the joinery. Yeah. And that has... All right, there's two in there. One is Mayday ice cream. And that is a kid's scoop of any ice cream flavor and a cup. And the other one is Gatello's. Two chicken tacos, marinated and chicken... Marinated chicken grilled to perfection served on a corn tortilla and topped with mojo sauce, onions, and cilantro, or fried cauliflower, guacamole, chipotle, adobo. And a lot of these, if you take them to go, in the center of the park, they're gonna have tables set up for you yeah. to eat there. Uh, but I know inside the joinery, you can eat in there. Or outside. Yes. And, or you could just walk around the lake, because if you walk around the lake that way, it'd take you back to Main where street. everything's at right. and where we messed up is we could have walked from the recreation to here Straight. we accidentally went that way yeah. because we didn't know this turned into main street again and then we came this way so i mean you have plenty of options to yeah. eat out of here oh, if yeah. you choose this area yeah. here okay what's number five uh, no that four was maydays right five is gatello okay and six is jimmy john uh, well, we got to go right back to where we were by the recreation. <laughs> yep, and we're going in order. So the so if you decide to come here and go out of order because they're next to each other, they that's fine. That. But we're going to go in the number order yeah, and turn it into a stroll. Them. Yeah. And that's the Amtrak Look at this station way. right there. You're eating and getting your exercise all yes. at the same time. Yep burn them carbs <laughs> especially that ice cream <laughs> especially the ice cream all right bb they got water fountains for short people medium people and tall people or oh you turned it on for the short people yeah so here maybe it's over here for the medium people okay and what about over there is for the tall people so if you're small yep. there you go medium tall so if we knew where we were going after the rec room we could have went that way towards the joinery, then come back up this way where Jimmy John's is going to be to the left. Right. Okay. See, we're already GPS uh, in our brain. We're not map readers no more. <laughs> we're already conformed to GPS. <laughs> well, no, I was just looking no, at No, I'm saying it's, we got confused. Yeah. We, I mean, because we're so used to the, relying on the GPS, GPS, you know, maps are, awesome. you know, I mean, before we knew the maps like the back of our heads and now if it doesn't have a GPS, 
Look at us. <laughs> we're, we're, we're driving around town like the GPS. <laughs> All right, BB, that's Jimmy John's. What does Jimmy John's have to offer here? A third of a new Cypress Salami Pesto. Salami fresh mozzarella, basil pesto, slow roasted tomatoes, balsamic glaze, oil, oregano, onion, and a mayo sandwich. All right, next is the Susie Hibachi place. As you can see, it's sunny, but they do have the table set up, and they have this gentleman that's always at the market. Yes. Uh, thing. The Harana Sound. So. He does events and everything. And over there's going to be. That's it. And that's where we ate at. That's where we did a live one time. The Tsunami Sushi and Hibachi. And it looks like they opened up a bodega market. They did. But that's not part of the thing. No. All right, what do these right, people offer? A free, a sample of a Freedom Roll, which is a fresh alai tuna crab, cucumber, and cream cheese with avocado on the outside and topped with a mixture of spicy tuna, crab, I don't know what this is, crumbs. Tempura crumbs, scallions. And a savory Freedom Aloha sauce. All right, let's go over there and then let's look at this bodega real quick, but we'd they had good food in there. Definitely yeah. good. And then they got this bodega here, which they got deli snacks, uh, cold cuts, vegetables, and drinks. And we'll have to check them out one day. We'll have to check them out. All right, the next one on the list is Black and Blurt Fruit. Right, which is right over there. Crush them Park. And we did this place. This place is amazing. Yeah. They had that coffee or something for that you drank. Oh, the the um, cafe de leche. Yes, and they have de deli style. And that's so good. Yeah, and you know down there, I think that dark gaming world, they're trying to get a bar in there or something mm. underneath there. But yeah. okay. Where's the lights flashing? Because they turned this into a four-way stop. I don't know if it's for today's event or always, but okay. And this is Black and Brew. I like this. Where place. we've DoorDash. That's the and cigar place. And we've eaten out of. Yeah. All right. All right. So black and Brew. Oh my gosh! Look at that pistachio bacala ice latte. Ooh. I think I want one. Mm, that does sound good. All right. All right. With them, it's a spring seasonal sandwich, ham and pimento, sourdough with smoked ham, house-made dill pickles, and spicy creamy pimento sauce. Okay. And it is good. And I think I'm gonna get that pistachio latte. Yes. All right. Wow, that looks good. That does look good. So let's go order some yeah. of them. Yeah, we've eaten here before, but we're not participating again in the thing, but if, even if we did, that's not on that list. <laughs> but uh, you always got to get something from this place. Always, I love it. They even had a banana bread shake and espresso. If we looked at the other side of the sign. <laughs> okay, even though, again, we didn't participate in it, we got this one here, the pistachio one. And I'm telling you, the caramel and everything is perfect. Then the lady was saying there was some kind of winter tea, but that only comes around the winter or something tea. Yeah. Uh, but that only comes around the winter, she says. All right, and then we have the I mean, I just want to say one thing. Uh, even though I didn't get it on video, we've already talked to three, four people and all friendly. Everyone talks to each other. The lady was asking us about the drink. So Lakeland, like I'm telling you, when you do come here, no one's stuck up or nothing. Uh, it's a very friendly, friendly town. Okay, what's the next one now? The Lakeland Loft. 
That's this one right here, the cigar place. Yeah. All right, what comes with the cigar place? Same oh wow. Your choice of peach Where'd you get the berries? chicken from? Moho Federal. Moho. Oh very, shoot. Very, very okay. Very okay. Yeah. yeah. This one probably. I would definitely pass. Would on have, that would have passed. Oh, okay. This one was the back nine one. Oh, okay. Oh, all right, all right. But this. Yeah, <laughs> these look cool. I would try to eat it, but it looks Yeah, it looks... The palace pizza was good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That palace pizza is amazing. Yeah. yeah. So, oh, okay. It's fun. <laughs> hey, what's not on the, the thing is this pistachio we just tried over here at Black and Brews. And they have a put... No, 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 no. No, no, this isn't on it, but this... But I promise you, this tastes good if you just want to buy something. You'll see the sign when you go to the brews, because that's the next one. Ice latte. Yes, yes. All right, and that's the cigar place. Right. It's a sample of your choice of peach, raspberry, or watermelon sangria, or a draft beer. Okay. And you see, I was telling you, just ask them people a question. Very friendly. Very and uh you're here to have a good time you could probably meet people uh yeah. make friends with people you know if you don't even have to make friends with people you can make acquaintances yeah. on the street you know that's it more beautiful artwork always got beautiful artwork in my thing always okay okay what's the next one is going to be that the federal then probably no it's not it's no? the back nine the back nine Back nine is ten, so it's got to be in here somewhere. So you have the mojos there, but the mojos is there, and the back nine is connected to it and stuff. So let me tell you what back nine has: French toast, baked brochet bread, brown sugar, cinnamon, nutmeg, and vanilla baked to perfection. Top with candied pecans and drizzled with house-made icing and caramel. I think that's what she was saying yeah. that she was eating. Yeah. Right there. And, and then now with Mojo's, um, Mojo's Federal Wine and Spirits, it smoked wings with sauce. And that's what he and had what there in had. his thing. Okay. Let's go. Next is a little bit of long walk. Yeah, because now we gotta go. To because the we gotta go to the Axe. And this is uh, the Mojo's. Mm -hmm. Right here. And again. And that actually used to be a federal bank back in the day. Wow. And again, like I said, people friendly. All right. Axe caliber is on orange. Right. So we have to go down, down that way and then, and then make a left. Yeah, yeah I guess they are turning Yeah, four-way stops. Down. Inside oh, the center. The bear. The bear. The bear. The bear. The bear. This is off the chain. I this know drink. It. <laughs> it hits the spot right now. It does. And I'm trying to mix it up at the bottom because I've got some nutmeg at the bottom. Yeah, there. see that. Let me tell you what, Black and Brew also makes the best latte. Oh my God. And sandwiches. Oh. A breakfast sandwich is good. Yeah, her breakfast sandwiches are And good. everything there's not expensive. No. It's not Reasonable. expensive. The Axe Caliber. All right, now this one. Meat Lovers Flatboard. That's it? That's it, right there. And here they have Axe throwing a coffee house, gourmet food, lunch late night, breakfast evening, virtual range, and other stuff. And it's family friendly, y'all. And I think it takes this whole block, if I'm not yeah, mistaken. I think it does. Yeah, I think it takes this whole block. So if you're in the Axe room, 
you go. <laughs> we you gotta do that. Learn. We gotta do that one day. Okay. We gotta do it. That might be actually fun. I think it would be. I don't think we ever did it. No, we never did. I mean, we've seen them live. We were to do it at the medieval festival, the Renaissance festival, but we didn't. Instead, yeah. I did the uh, archery. Yeah, but this whole thing is, is, uh. Shit, I would love to get back into that, but I can't with my arm. The Excalibur. Someone may ask with arrows. But that's how big this building yeah. is, y'all. Yeah, it is. Definitely. So the next one we're going to is the pita pit, which we've also made over there. Yes. And that's good. Ooh, it's getting windy. But it feels good. Alrighty. The pita pit, straight ahead. And we are surprised that the Frescoes is not participating, but it could change every month. Yeah. You don't know, because the ticket is not for the so restaurant. Check on that. It's just the ticket. Alrighty. Sorry for the wind, guys. Right. Sorry for the wind. Can we get up here? And we've eaten here before. Yeah, it's pretty good. Alright. Alright, Pita Pit. Sample of a chicken Caesar wrap. Okay. So that's not bad. All right, and Descent Craft Brewing. Which is right there. Right oh, there I never seen it. that. And, this and that's right there, right there. It's five ounce samples of one of our 12 craft brews on draft. Gotcha. And then we're gonna go straight down here to the cake makers. Alrighty. I'm so forever with the, this cocktail bar. Mm -hmm. And this is the cake makers right here. Right here. And what are they giving there? All right, now with this one, it is choose your sample from an assorted pastry or a kid's scoop of ice cream or a coffee. All right, next spot. Oh, it's right next door. Yep. And that's the Irish pub. Oh, there you go. I'm break my neck. Keep drinking. <laughs> and this is a latte. All right, with this one, six ounce sample of select select draft must be 21 years or older. Okay. And then and we're gonna walk back over there because that's where the taco bus is. Yeah. Over there. And then the Pizza Palace is the last of it over there. All right, that's the taco bus over there guys which i i am not fully impressed with that no, place yeah uh, with the taco bus you get a single taco and a churro uh, steak chicken or portobello mushroom as a vegetarian option additional options or toppings are extra and wow. uh that's uh palace pizza right there we've eaten with dave and deb deb yeah and with that you either get a choice of a pepperoni pizza bites or a small cannoli with a sweet, a small cannoli with a sweet ricotta cheese and chocolate chips. And that's it, 18. Mm -hmm. 18 places to eat at. And you figure if you stop by, is there what, only four that have alcohol? Uh, one, two. Four that have alcohol. Now, if you went to every place and you ate at it, you're gonna be full. Yeah, those are those uh, wings that he had. He had about those are some nice wings. drumsticks. Yeah. Yeah. And he looked like he had about six or eight of them. So I mean, they're they're giving you good portions, mm -hmm. at least samples. I mean, they're not giving you platefuls, but they, like I said, you you eat enough samples, you'll get filled up. Oh heck yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's like just eating appetizers. Now we did eat at that All American gym. It's all right. Uh, the only bad thing about that is the service wasn't 
but that was many many years ago so you never know they might have changed yeah uh but she's gonna let us go Let's okay go thank on. you thank you but yeah we did the chop shop with dave yeah and deb deb all righty this was good here i feel like getting another one Damn. and this is 18 this is mama's we were here live with carlos And this is where I had to slice the pizza that day we were at the market. Yeah. That was pretty good too. Pretty good. And they do have outside eating. Yes, they do have as well. And we ate there before. So pretty nice. Beautiful day today, not hot, not muggy. Just gotta be careful with the sidewalks. Yeah, baby's gotta <laughs> The roots are growing in <laughs> heavily and stuff. So, <laughs> and I think they just probably changed all the lights to four way stops down here. I think so. And I don't know if it's for the event or just because, but all righty. More people are starting to come out, and this is till nine o'clock. Like I said, so it's still early. We came out here early. This is gonna get more busier as the time goes crazier, by. Because yeah. it's it's not that late yet. A lot of people ain't out of work yet. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people are just just what you call calling. Getting out of work, getting ready to come here, getting the kids ready out of school, do their homework and everything. Alrighty, we're back to the car. So what did you think of it? I think it's nice. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's how many miles did we walk? I'll tell you that. In That's a, a good one right there. To know, even with the mess up. But like I said, now that we know how to read the map better, you don't have to go to all of them. Because you think about it, if you don't drink, why you want to walk to the Swan? Right. You know, if you don't want no teriyaki, why you want to walk over there? We walked almost two miles. So that's not uh, bad. Yeah, two miles. So two miles of walking. So you and we walked. We didn't, other than stopping at the mm -hmm. brew, the black and brew. The track. <laughs> yeah, other than walking the black and brew, I mean, sitting inside there waiting on the the latte. Yeah. If you think about it, every you're walking, you go in there, you might want to sit down or eat while you're walking. Uh. What time is it? It's six o'clock. Oh, wow. We got here about 4.30. Mm hmm Yeah. So, or f between 4.30 and 4.45, I'll say. Somewhere in there. And then six o'clock. So it's not bad. So even if you just want to come no, down here. it was 4.40. Okay, 4.40. Yeah. And it's six o'clock now? Yeah. So an hour and 20 minutes. So that's not bad. And again, we just walked it. We didn't spend time in each store so you figure you can be out here a couple hours or you can be out here like us not that long and still go home and the sun is not down yet and enjoy the day yeah. because sometimes with the sun hitting you sitting in that park that's all sun there it's not shaded it can get on you and uh, or you, the sun will drain you or at least you know this is open till nine o'clock and if you want to wait till the sun goes down like at seven o'clock yeah you know that at least you can do it in two hours. You can do it in less than two hours. And if you're not doing all the places, you specifically have places. Like I said, if you're not a drinker, why would right. you go to the places that drink? Right. So that cuts the time. Right. So then from there, you can do the other places less than two hours mm -hmm. and less than two miles. So yep. that's not bad. That's not bad So at all. check this place out in downtown Lakeland every third Tuesday. Tuesday. Right. Uh, you can buy the tickets online or you can go right there and pick it up uh, downtown. So until our next video, guys, everyone take care. Take care of one another. Take care of yourselves. And see y'all.